is up guys i'm back with another video guys i know it's been a long time since i uploaded an a7000 video but let's get into it guys so guys just head to this link in the description it'll just help you install the firmware i'll just explain quickly why we're going to install a firmware today we're actually going to install it work guys i finally fixed the black line issues funny story it actually happened to me and i was stuck for like two or three weeks that's why you guys didn't see uh, a uh, 2018 video for a very long time but guys now it's fixed so essentially you need to install a firmware from november 2020 guys it will be binary six so don't comment down below saying oh it's my one's binary six i can't do that i can't down guys we're not downgrading you can change it as long as it's binary six as you can see the one i'm highlighted guys download that one for whatever model number you have my one's the gnds so that's why i'm going to download this one but guys i finally found a solution after testing multiple firmwares because i was struggling because i thought i've officially updated my um a7 2018 but it wasn't the case and guys just download from some for survey it's not like sam mobile or sam fw it'll give you the fastest speed to download the firmware so yeah guys next thing tool we will be needing is odin so yeah guys i know most of you guys have used odin before it's just gonna what we're gonna use to flash the twerp and the uh, samsung firmware so yeah guys just click the download there and it should just start start downloading automatically so yeah guys as we do have a few seconds um expect more a7 2018 content guys lineage os android 12 multiple videos that guys are going to come out stay tuned for that so yeah guys now what i want you guys to do is just boot into download mode guys just hold the two volume up and down keys and plug in the power cable make sure the power cable is plugged into your pc and you have booted so yeah guys i'm just gonna quickly show you this image we just need to make sure you have downloaded this i also this is the thing you download from their website as you can see it has labels the ap bl cp we're just gonna put these in the odins which i'll show you in odin in just a moment so yeah as you can see on the right hand corner you have all of these guys there's something messed up with my screen recorder so essentially when i try to do it it's an error so i'm just so i didn't do didn't show you how I'm putting it in but guys just click the BL and then you would go back to the screenshot I showed you and whatever the file name is highlighted as BL you would put it in this category so then the BL would go into this essentially all of them will go very very fast guys but except the AP the AP does take some time but don't change anything in the option settings just let it stay let it reset the time it doesn't matter and yes guys once you have know it's been added you just get an added signal on the left hand corner it just shows you the thing has been added it's in, it's essential that you do get that added signal yeah um if you guys don't get it please do download the samsung drivers for your device i'll also link that link in the description below guys so yeah guys as we're waiting for this guys i want you to comment down below um, what videos do you guys want to see next guys i know mui is coming out lineage is coming out havoc is coming out guys more content is coming guys it was just no content coming out because i thought i bricked my a7 2018 i was getting the black lines and i couldn't find a solution but after excuse me guys after working so hard day and night i actually finally got it to work i actually just got it work a few hours ago i believe it was two hours ago yep um, I officially got it to work on the A7 2018. Um, it was a real struggle, guys. But, guys, I officially got it to work. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to fix it. It was pretty simple. You just had to install a patch in the same binary. Because I was trying to go from binary 6 to 5. But then I realized you're not allowed to do that. Because it will give you an error and it will break your device size. So, if it's binary 6, you can go through versions very easily. So, yeah, guys. Um, make sure you just... If Samsung ever does release a binary 7, which I highly doubt it, um, just don't go to binary 7, yeah? But binary 6, you guys can move throughout. So, guys, make sure to remember to download November 2020. Guys, it will be uploaded on December because it was made on November 29th and it rolled out officially on December 1st. So, yeah, guys, just continue adding the files to twerp. The last file is here. Um, it's just a CSC. And yes, guys, so just go to option, guys. Do not touch any of the options and just click start, guys. And guys, don't worry. I'm not going to extend this video and keep talking while this thing goes. I'll just skip it over. See you guys back in just a moment. So, yeah, guys, so now it's done. Um, so now your phone should right now be automatically booting into Twitter. I mean, not, not into Twitter, to the official OS for the November 2021 patch. Let's just take a look at the phone. So, yeah, guys, so 
as you can see the phone is booting guys this might take some time maybe five ten minutes because it is the first boot after installing a firmware so yeah guys so just set up the phone quickly so yeah guys i've set up the phone and now you guys just before you turn off your phone and reboot back into download mode i just need you to open the developer options and check if oem oem unlocking is unlocked guys this is very important if it's not unlocked your phone can get bright guys please um just make sure it's unlocked or it will not work it's very important after you have powered off the device just unblock it and so yeah guys you see me struggling to put a usb port into a desktop i do apologize but guys just plug in your usb and hold down the volume down and up key and plug in the usb to boot into download mode bam there you go guys you officially booted down we'll click the volume up button as you can see it's been added to odin so you guys were back in odin guys um essentially we're gonna have to change some options this time in the option tabs in odin just because it will give you an error turn up auto boot and uh reset thing so now guys click on ap guys i didn't show it here but i also linked the twerp file inside the description guys you just have to put that in the ap file the same thing you did before so guys just click start recovery boom reset bang now pass guys now it's officially has been installed twerp successfully so yeah guys now we're just gonna head back to the phone guys unplug the power cable and guys hold down the volume down and power key until you get a black screen and guys this is very important do not let it boot into the os and quickly change your finger to the volume up key and now you're gonna see it's gonna successfully boot yourself into twerp so yeah guys that's the end of the video i hope you guys enjoy make sure to like subscribe share and guys more videos are coming soon goodbye